What's up guys, this is Tom Hain from In This Moment, here to talk about the 5B nylon tip from Vader. It's everything I want in the stick. It's got a perfect taper, hickory, really strong wood, not too heavy, not too light, and the nylon tip is perfect for attack, and it's just really nice for me uh, because I use a lot of ride work and just makes me articulate everything I want the way I want it. It's perfect. Another great, great, great thing about Vader sticks that I've only found on Vader sticks is that these tips do not come off. I don't know what they put on these things, but it's phenomenal. Uh, I headbang a lot. I don't really see what's going on most of the time, but I can always feel when a tip flies off. And I've had so many shows where, you know, the tip flies off on other brand sticks and all of a sudden my stick is going through my head and it's a nightmare. You know, you just, with this, I never have to worry about it. Every night, performs the same way. Perfect. A little bit of background about myself. Uh, I started drumming when I was three years old. I just turned 23. I'm from Chicago. I was, I've been in bands my whole life. Really started to really kind of try and make it when I turned 16 and uh, proved to be, you know, a little difficult when you can't really you know, leave school or, you know, really follow your dreams. But the second I graduated, I knew this is what I wanted to do, and I just kind of worked my way through the Chicago land circuit, and uh, eventually the my band at the time broke up, and I heard about in this moment needing a drummer, and I thought, hey, that'd be pretty crazy if I could make that work somehow. Got a hold of their email address, sent Chris, the guitar player, sent him some stuff, and. Uh, he saw some live footage, some studio footage, and uh, right after that he says, hey man, when can we talk? So we Skyped right after that, and it just was, it was one of those things. He's like, do you think you can do this? Do you think you can play our music? And I was like, yeah, man, I can, I can do it, I can do it. And uh, he's like, all right, well, we want you to go to Australia to try out. And I'm like, to try out? Okay, okay. So we're going to Australia playing Soundwave Festival, which the first two days were like 150,000 people, a complete, uh, it just turned my life upside down when I was there. It was a complete, you know, completely amazing time. And uh, halfway through those shows, Chris said, if you want the gig, and I said, yes. <laughs> and, uh, and I'm here now, I've been touring with them for a little over a year now, and we'll be guaranteed hitting a, a tour near you, so. Come check us out, it's in this moment. Just a little advice to anybody out there that, that really wants to try and uh, take a step into getting into this industry. I would just say, do everything you can to put yourself out there. Um, when I was in a local band in Chicago for years, I would just put, you know, like studio footage of me drumming, um, you know, recording the album, or live footage of me, you know, playing a show. Like, make sure that you, you do everything you can to get your name out there. Um, there's also, you know, a million other websites that you can you can utilize. Uh, you know, you have YouTube, Facebook. I uh, heard MySpace might be coming back. Uh, you know, the list goes on and on. But just do everything you can to make yourself known. If you Google your name, make sure it's something that's up. That's you know that you can be proud of, and that would make people want to pursue you. Thanks for listening to me talk. Uh, be sure to check out In This Moment. We're on tour right now with Stone Sour and Hell or High Water. We'll be hitting a state near you if we already haven't. And uh, if you're from overseas, we're going to be hitting all of Europe in a little bit, so stay tuned. Thanks.